Hi everybody, my name is Antoinette and welcome to Board Game Inquisition, where we're here to offer you insight and indeed information about the board game you might want to have in your collection. So today we're going to be talking about Everdell and if you're not familiar with Everdell you might want to go and check out my review first because this mini review is for its first expansion, Pearlbrook. Everdell, the Pearlbrook expansion, has your critters exploring further beyond the woodlands to below the surface of the river where a new civilization of waterfolk is waiting. I'm using the collector's edition and it feels like it's brimming with extras to add to your game. In the box you get new meadow cards such as critters, buildings and events, 3D cardboard monuments which are new endgame scoring objectives, open and close signs to mark cards that are open to any player, the very shiny pearl resources, new adornment cards, these give you bonuses but cost you a pearl, river destinations, frog tokens to use on your adventures in Pearl Brook, and new forest locations to add further variety to the board. How different is the Pearl Brook expansion from what's in the original Everdell base game? Well, the first thing you have to notice is that there's new ways for end game scoring, and these come in the form of the monuments. Now, the monuments are worth a lot of points, but they also require a lot of resources to be able to obtain them. But it's nice to have another way to score other than what's written on your cards. The second addition is this new resource, which are pearls. And there are quite a few things that require pearls to activate them. However, they're not as easy to obtain as other resources. Um, you can't go to a spot on the board and claim them. Meaning you have to kind of plan ahead with them and use them wisely throughout the game. On a whole, gameplay really isn't affected by this new expansion. There just seems to be further ways to win. How does the Pearlbrook expansion affect the base Everdell game? Well, truth be told, not particularly. It's quite an insular expansion um, and doesn't really mix well with the Everdell that we're kind of used to. Even these new pearl resources refer only to all of the new cards. Um, now, apart from that, this does add a, random, a more random element to Everdell than we're used to. Um, and you see this in the case of there are locations to go in the river. Um, and to go there, you need to pass certain prerequisites. And once you get there, you get to flip the card face up so you don't know what was there. And if you can complete whatever it says on it, you'll get bonuses and all sorts of good things. Now, the issue here is that you don't know what you need before you go there. So it can be completely arbitrary whether you happen to have um, what the location requests of you or not. And this is compounded by the fact that you have one meeple that works in Pearlbrook, the frog. And so you can only go to one space a season while you're over there. Um, it's a little bit funny. Um, I think some people will appreciate this random element others not so much but for me it was a kind of a, a different take um, on what we're used to in Everdell. Is this expansion worth having? Well I do think the Pearl Brook expansion really kind of opens up the realm of Everdell a little bit and offers you kind of new ways to play. Now the nice thing is this still keeps all the mechanisms we're familiar with and it adds new content without overloading you with new ideas. On a whole, I feel like the Pearlbrook expansion kind of dilutes the focus of Everdell itself, but if you're looking for more ways to win, then this one is definitely worth checking out. You've been watching Board Game Inquisition. For further updates about my latest videos, why not like or subscribe to the channel? Or if you've got any comments or queries you'd like to make about Everdell Pearlbrook, you can leave them in the comment box below. And until next time, I'll be here playing games, asking questions, and of course, perusing my collection. Take care.